now let's quickly look at the difference between IPv4 and IPv6 header. Now to the left is an IPv4 header. It's 20 byte in length and it's composed of 14 fields. Okay, so if you were to count all these fields in this header, they're 14, trust me. Go ahead and count them. And if you look at the IPv6 header to the right, in contrast, it's double in length, it's 40 byte, but it's a lot more simplified. It's only eight fields as opposed to 14 fields. So it's been really, really optimized. You have different fields like version that actually says it's version six, traffic class is used for QoS, flows is used for the sequence of packets and to avoid packet reordering, payload length is all about payload, next header is the extension header that we talked about which allows a lot of flexibility to IPv6, hop count, basically TTL in IPv4 has been renamed to hop limit in IPv6 header and then we have a 128-bit source address, and then we have a 128-bit destination address. And to the left, the legend here shows all the fields that have actually been removed or pulled from IPv6 to make the header more streamlined. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give me a thumbs up, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.